Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about work, word, problems. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. Working alone, Mary and Trayvon can inflate 20 balloons in 7.34 minutes. Had he done it alone, it would have taken Trayvon 14.1 minutes. How long would it take Mary to do it alone? Okay, so let's write down what we know. We know the work of inflating 20 balloons is equal to Trayvon's rate times 14.1 minutes. They tell us if Mary had done it alone, well that's what we want to find, so the work is equal to Mary's rate times time. So we don't really know that information there. But we know that they did it together, the work of 20 balloons, and we had Mary's rate plus Trayvon's rate, it took them a total of 7.34 minutes. Okay, so where can we go from here? Well, this equation, kind of wrote it kind of close here, but 20 equals t times 14.1, let's go find Trayvon's rate. Trayvon's rate is equal to 20 over 14.1. One here. And that's going to be helpful. So we're going to take that and we're going to substitute it in for t right here. So we have 20 equals m plus 20 over 14.1 times 7.34. And now we have enough information to solve, well, for m. I'm going to divide, so this is multiplication, divide both sides by 7.34. I'm going to have a lot of decimals here. And so we have 20 over 7.34 is equal to m plus 20 over 4.1. And then we're going to subtract a 20 over 4.1 here to both sides. And make sure you keep everything lined up. And we have, well, Mary's rate is going to be approximately, okay, so it's going to be by itself now because this will cancel. Is approximately in 20 over 7.34 minus 20 over 14.1. Uh, Oof, if you caught that mistake, let me know. Be careful, sorry about that. This is 14.1 down here in the denominator, so make sure you fix that or add that if you've been following along. Sorry about that. But we all make mistakes, all right? So give me a like for that. <laughs> That'll just show all the good stuff. All right, well that comes out to be when we subtract them, a approximately 1.306. All right, so what can we do here? Well, we know Mary's rate here. We, when we found Mary's rate, and we actually know the work is gonna be 20 balloons. So 20 balloons is equal to 1.306 times times, and we're substituting that in here. So now time by itself, we divide by 1.306 to both sides. And Mary's time it takes her to blow up the 20 balloons, inflate 20 balloons, is approximately 15.31 minutes. And that is our final answer. I hope this video was helpful. And if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minutemathtutor.com